Perhaps you've seen this on YouTube. It's a fire tornado. It's two of nature's most horrifying elements jammed together in one package. To find out how and when these things occur, I asked Marino De Marzo of the University of Maryland's Department of Fire Protection Engineering to explain them to us, and he did us one better. He agreed to make one for us in his lab. The fire tornadoes form because in a fire there is a substantial updraft due to the fact that the flame is hot and wants to rise. And if there is any rotational effect in that, that effect amplifies the flame and stretch it. And as it stretches, the flame becomes like a column and becomes much more intense. And at that point, the tornado feeds on itself. In nature, they are very rare. They, cause, they are caused because uh, essentially there is a, a certain point in these random motions, it gets organized in a rotational fashion. And then once it gets to that point, the fire tornado starts, but that's a random event. In fact, they are very uncommon. The fire tornado is much more dangerous than normal fires because the combustion rate is much higher, and as a result of that, the radiation that comes out of the flame is much higher, and whatever is around the fire gets this enhanced amount of heat that can cause trouble. For Discovery News, I'm James Williams, and that is Fire Tornadoes Explained.